As you can see, we didn't get a visit from Krampus this year because we got the second of six big old boxes of stuff, this one being the December box. So, do you have a cold or do you have a stitch in your side? I have a cold and I really should see my doctor whose name is Bruce Wayne and will probably have a Big Bang Theory that I should go back to the future and get well. Those are some really bad puns, y'all. We should just open the box and see what's inside. Hi Internet, it's Lee. I'm Taylor. And I apologize for my voice, it's kind of going. I got one of those horrible winter colds. But this is the last uh, big old box of stuff of the year. Uh, this is two of six. Taylor and I went on their website. We um, clicked the things we liked. Last month was a good month. Last month was great. I'm going to let you open this one. Do that. And we're going to see what's in. Uh, Team Bobos are, are a wonderful uh, company. They're on Facebook, they're on Twitter. Uh, I think they're on Instagram, I'm not 100% certain. I'm not sure. But um, their presence on Facebook is great. If you're not already friends with them, go ahead and friend. Yeah, they're uh, great. They're yeah. fantastic. Um, it, is, it is a little family run company and they post all family pictures and stuff of you know when they went to see Star Wars and all that kind of good stuff. They're so just they're, like my mother with the tape on Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> That was Kristen laughing. Goodness. The they do like to take their boxes up, which is good. And this one, I don't know if you saw, had a little Christmas tree on. So that was very kind of cool. cute. If not, we'll do a close up. Or you can check out it. Check us out on Instagram. We'll post a picture of it on there. All right. So paper. The first, first item is paper. Oh, and they look. They put Merry Christmas on the inside of the box. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. We'll do a close up of that as well. Okay, here's close up of the paper. That's a good one. I do need some more wrap. No, I'm joking. Alright, so what we got? Oh, thank go alert. More paper! More paper. This one's gonna have a heart attack as she sees all this paper on the floor. Yeah, well, it's okay. Okay. There's so much Doctor Who. Is there really? Yes! Well, we're gonna be fighting over this Doctor Who stuff, I'm gonna tell you now. Oh my, oh my gosh. A Comic Con exclusive Cyberman. Cyber leader. He's the leader. I wish we had got that one. That is cool though. Careful that he's coming out. How, oops. How old is this? You see a date on it? This is one of the old classic figures, I think, but that is really cool. It's officially licensed. Yep, and it's an Entertainment Earth Comic Con exclusive. We'll put a close up of that over there, but it's the old style Cyberman, which is really neat. 1996. Nice. I think. That's awesome. Okay, here's awesome, a... Awesome, awesome, awesome. Science fiction mystery mini. I'll let you open that. Oh, can I borrow the knife? Because these things are painting the butt to get in. Yes, they are. Here you go. So these things have been pretty popular. Um, I gotta be honest with you. I don't actually get these very... I don't, I don't really understand what the whole point of this... Get... Sorry. Fangirl alert. <laughs> I don't understand what the point is of these boxes when you don't know what you're getting. I kind but of they enjoy do them. seem very popular and they do wrap that crap out of them. Yeah, they're supposed to be a mystery. Wouldn't be fun Ooh. if you know exactly what it was. What is it? Um It's Doc Brown. Oh Back to the Future. That's kinda cute. That's pretty cool. Okay, I'll give you that one. That's actually kinda cute. That is cute. Okay. Scoop. Scoop, I'll give you that one. Okay, what else we got? A calling Batman magnet. Nice with Adam West. Yes. Sweet. Because I'm Batman. She's Batman. I'm Batman. Oh, let's try and have Maddie eat this again. But this time it's Back or to the gum. Future. Yeah. Back to the Future packs. Both of us love to put these things in. They're the like classics from what year is that? Back to the Future 2 is probably going to be like 80 something. Uh. Back to the Future 2, babe. Probably about 87, I'm guessing. 89, 89 from this. Not a bad guess, but... This is, um... This is... Nine movie cards, one sticker, and a stick of bubblegum, which... Um, is probably, what, 30 years old at this point, and... The last time we got one of these, Maddie tried eating it, and she almost broke a tooth did. on it. So, yeah, you too. You as well, but... Anyway. Yeah, I spit mine out, though, because it tasted like chalk. 
So, so I love the way they do these. This is kind of neat. Uh -huh. Brings back a lot of memories for me. Some pins in there. What we got? Yeah, they're Krampus. Pins. Oh, for Krampus? Yeah. Look, look up close. They're Krampus, taking the children and dressing like Santa Claus. Nice. We'll put a little close-ups down here. These both are of cool. These. I like those. And then. That is cool. This is Maddie's. What is it? It's one of the Dorb, the Dorb's vinyl figures. Oh my god! But it is from her favorite Disney movie, yeah, this Lilo is, and yeah. Stitch. And this is Stitch. Stitch. That's a great her little figure. Her all-time favorite. She does love Stitch. I know. Yeah. So we'll give Maddie this one. That's Maddie's. That's pretty cool. I like that. That's a pretty good sculpt as well. It's kind of a weird looking thing, but it's cool. And then what have we got next? Something for Big Bang Theory. Big Bang Theory. Yeah. Love my Big Bang Theory. Bazinga. <laughs> it's a magnet, magnet set. set of the whole cast of Big Bang. That's pretty cool. Those will be going on the fridge. Bazinga. Kristen's laughing at that from the from behind the camera. Those are, that's cool, actually. Yeah. I like that. That's pretty good. You got a candy cane. You got to have a candy cane at Christmas. Of course. And okay. then it appears that we have, um, yep, Krampus stickers. A little bit late for Christmas, but we were a little bit late getting the box this time, so. That's okay, though. We'll put They're really good, pi um, like, pictures on them, on the stickers. They really are. They're kind of cool. Nice. So another great bow box. Absolutely. Um, big old box of stuff. They make it, make it real personal, and they do a terrific job. I really, I'm really glad we found this company. Um, and thanks to uh, Angie Arthur. She was the one who put us on to this, and we'll put yeah. a link to her uh, YouTube down there. She put us onto this, and this is this is one of my favorite boxes of all. Oh, um, I would definitely say this is probably uh, this is this is the top one of the top three for me. Yeah, I love this box. Yeah, just because you make it so personal, and you can do a set of three or six. Or well, I think yeah, and 12. then you could even uh, just their presence in social media alone. Yeah, it definitely makes a difference. Really on, does. On you know the not the, the quality of it actually. You feel like you're getting something that's actually custom tailored to you rather than here a million other people got the same thing. Yeah. I mean, the things are nice. Yeah. But the mm. fact that it is tailored for Taylor, so to speak, um, <laughs> is really good. But, <laughs> We're so funny. <laughs> anyway, please like, share, subscribe, and comment. Uh, we do have the Instagram account, which Taylor's now running, uh, doing a great job on that. So please sign up for there. It's uh, Instagram.com slash. Uh, Geek Pride Sack. All right, but in the meantime, this is the last video of all for the year. Um, happy New Year. Happy New Year to everybody, and we'll see you in 2016 with more videos. Thank you for the support, and thank you for watching. We really appreciate it. We have a lot of fun doing this, and we we'll will see, see you, you next year. year. Bye.